Excuse me. Hi, I'm here to interview for the internship. Wrong office. Oh, okay. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, how much is this internship paying? Nothing. It's an internship, so I work for free. Wait, wait, wait. Sorry, sorry. Uh, I, let me get this straight. You show up looking like that, which is really sexy, by the way, and you work for free? Mm-hmm. And what exactly do you do? Whatever they tell me to do. Really? <sighs> so, tell me why you want to work at Red Bedroom Records. I'm a big fan of hip-hop. Fantastic. We do hip-hop. I'm really into techno. Deep house. I love the Deep House. Mm. Well, I love country music. Yeah, we don't do country music here. But Alex Dupre. Yeah, I was, I was just... Let me give you a parting gift. Yeah. There you go. You're welcome. I'm sorry. I was under the impression I was interviewing for an internship. But the post said to bring a bikini? Yeah, occasionally we do our own video shoots here. We might need you as an extra. Did you bring the bikini? No. But I have a bra on. Will that work? That'll do just fine. To be honest, we don't even like music. We hate it. That's fine. When can you guys start? I guess now if you want. Perfect. What do you want us to do? I don't know. Ben, stretch. Just sit here and look pretty. I'm going to grab some breakfast. Should I answer the phone? Oh, answer the phone. Good call. Is he dead yet? I don't think so. Go check his pulse or something. He's not dead. He's right. He's not dead yet. Boy, I'd sure hate to own this place. Why? What's that supposed to mean? Well, kidnapping, aggravated assault. Dude. Relax. You shut up. What are you doing here anyway? Well, I came to help, but Chris Keller's too pretty to go to prison. Yeah, that's what I said. You said Chris Keller was pretty? Nobody's going to prison. Wait, no, 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 no. Not the big guy. What happened to the little Marty the midget-sized guy? Come on. They sent Drago out. Oh, Chris Keller does not like this. Chris Keller's work here is done! Excuse me, um, hi. I just need to talk to someone about my husband. He's um, Nathan Scott, and he's missing. How long has he been missing? Well, he was supposed to come home last night at 9 o'clock, and he We didn't... can't file a report until 24 hours have passed. Whoa, whoa, that's it? 24 hours. Did you see Training Day? You know Denzel was the bad guy in that Chris, movie. Chris, don't. You're going to make it worse. I don't like your tone. I don't like lazy cops. I'm sorry. Look, Peacock, we have rules for a reason. Men leave their wives every day, especially professional athletes. Oh, okay, so, hey, no, now we're making generalizations. So you're the jackass in high school who now gets to harass people and carry a gun. Can you give us a moment? Okay. All right, look, buddy, I know this woman. She wouldn't be here if there wasn't a problem. Nathan Scott's a good guy, a great father, a responsible husband. Come on, man, even if he wasn't, would you leave her? Something's wrong here, I promise. She just needs someone to make her feel better and make her feel like everything's going to be okay. This is Scott. I'll do what I can do, okay? But I can do a lot more for you after 24 hours. We're the one you to screw to get a burger around here. Please let it be you. You ordered a burger? No. Originally, I ordered a breakfast burrito. We don't serve those after 11. Well, you did an hour ago when I ordered it. But seeing as it's lunchtime, you can get me a burger. 
Come with me. Ooh. Lunchtime quickie. Nice. Hey, uh, a few more minutes on your burgers, folks. Like seven minutes. Put this on. You can cook, right? Chris Keller can do it all, baby. No, you can't be honest. I can be honest. No, you can't. I kissed Haley at the masquerade party. Ow! Whoa! Man, I was trying to help you. Ah! See, this is why I'm never honest. God, stop hitting me. Stop kissing my wife. I will when you start kissing her. Oh. <sighs> What the hell is wrong with you? Listen, the night you called me to come to town was the night of the masquerade party. I thought it'd be funny if we both went in the same costume, so I bribed the guy at the costume shop to tell me what you rented. But then I got there, and I saw you and Haley weren't getting along, so I thought if I just kissed her, I'd okay, it was stupid, all right? But I did it for you. I didn't do it for me. <laughs> so even? Even? You kissed my wife, you lost all my money, you lied to me about a poker game, and you got me attacked by a munchkin and a transvestite. Whoa, whoa. You think Emmanuel's a dude? Emmanuel has an Adam's apple. Oops. You want to know the worst part? Haley's the one that suffers the most. She put her heart and soul into that song, and you screwed her over. It's nice work. You should be proud of that. Keller. Well, well. Heard you were on the lam. I was. Unnecessary, I'm told. But does anyone text Chris Keller? Apparently not. Hey, Nate, listen. I'm sorry to hear about your dad. Yeah. I appreciate that. Anyway, uh, I didn't get a chance to say thank you, so this is just a small way of saying it now. Open it up. What? No way, dude! This looks just like the guitar I sold to get Haley or Masters back. Well, it's not just like the guitar. It is the guitar. What? You found Haley James? Oh. Mm. You named your guitar after my wife? No. No, um, I named it after the porn star. This is, wow, come here. Whoa. <laughs> all right. Uh, OK, all right. Man. Welcome. And hey, good luck tonight. I heard there's some big shot label guy here, so. Yeah, Frank Parks. Could be a big night. There it is. Hey, Nate. I'm really glad you're OK. For Haley, I mean. Thanks. Hey, do you remember the first time we met? It was right here, like 10 years ago. It's been all downhill from there, huh? Dude, we seriously need some tunes. No, don't. Uh, Holy day. It's jam. Oh, come on, man. What's a road trip without Holy some day. road tunes? This is the best day. Listen to me. This is not a road trip. This is a business trip to fix your screw up. And we get the money, we get Haley's song, and if you're lucky, I don't rearrange your face. Fine. Jeez. The ice cream day. I am only a man. By the way, how's your poker game? What? Just, that's how we're gonna get the money back. Playing poker. Oh. Ow! Hey, I fixed it. All you had to do was keep your word, and you couldn't do it. Take the money, pay the studio, and help Haley. I am trying to help. It's a hundred dollar buy, and I got about five hundred bucks. Okay, it's either this, or you can say goodbye to Haley's demo. I thought you said you lost all the money. Oh, I did. 
the money your dad paid me last week to seduce him. Ow, man, my head. Dan Scott, sleeping in my guest room. How much worse can you get? Why do I say these things? Well, well. Nathan Scott. Chris Keller, what are you doing here? I run Red Bedroom Records. Didn't Haley tell you? Apparently, my wife no longer tells me things. It was... My discreet I like. Don't come in. What do you want? Um, I heard Nathan was leaving. How did you hear Nathan was leaving? Your sister told Alex, who told me. Anyway, I just came by to say, if you need anything while Nathan's gone, and I mean anything, you just let old Chris Keller know. Haley, I really am changed. Let's see here. Slept with you. Kissed you. Got slapped by you. Just like any other night on Chris Kelly's tour bus. So they can tell the car to Honey Grove, but come on around. Honey Grove, we're rolling right through there. You guys should just crash with me. Come on, it'll be like old times. You know, without Nate trying to kill me for singing duets with Haley. Hey, I'm down for all that. Yo, you got some gin in this joint? Full bar and back. I'm loving Chris Keller. Look, I got plenty of room. I'm going your way. Haley can sleep in my bed. Well, you're looking a little plump, Hales. What the hell? I have a bigger chunk in my bunk. I'm pregnant, you idiot. Oh. Dude, totally not mine. 